It's your time, it's his time, it's Bam's time, Bam's time to sign. Welcome back to the channel, man. It's been a couple days, it's been about five days, six days. Somebody correct me, I don't know, remember, I don't know how much. Long story short, finals week, finals week, finals week. Um, had to take care of some stuff. You know, basketball, we still hooping, we still doing our thing, trying to get somewhere. And yeah, so we back at it with the videos, man. I got another reaction to a music video requested, obviously. Uh, both hit me on the gram about this. Big man's P want to be reacted to this one song, and he got a feature, a uh, favorite of ours, uh, Book the Bishop on here. And then they got uh, Scotty No Pip, and I do know who that is, too. I, you know. So, let's get straight to the video. And actually, before we start this vid, I like I have to say this. It has nothing to do with the vid. If your team or a favorite player is no longer in the playoffs, especially after getting eliminated by if your favorite team or favorite player is no longer in the playoffs, you I like you really have to shut the fuck up cuz like <laughs> I like and I like I've never understood this philosophy that y'all try to do. That's like so let so let's say my guy loses in the playoffs, right? No, no, let's say let's say the 49ers lose. Let's say the 49ers lose to the Bengals, right? And it's a bunch of Niner fans talking crazy cuz the Bengals just lost in the Super Bowl or something, right? This is let's let, let, let's just put it out there like that. The Niners the Niners lost to the to the um Bengals Bengals in the playoffs. And the Niners is clowning talking crazy because the Bengals lost. Why do, why would Niner fans be talking about a team that beat them just cuz they lost? Bro, they beat you, they beat y'all. So how, that's like me getting my ass beat like whooped. And or that's like me whooping somebody ass, and then I get, and then I fight somebody else, and that person beat me, and then the person whose ass I whooped is trying to talk crazy about me, when bro I beat I beat your ass. So how, how can you talk crazy to me? I whooped you, but because somebody else beat me, who wasn't you, you could talk. That's how y'all look. Some of y'all this and with the playoffs going on in the NBA right now, I've never understood that philosophy. When LeBron lost in 2021 to the to the Suns, I'm not gonna I didn't talk crazy. I'm not gonna talk. Why would I talk crazy? I'm not trying to stop the fandom or nothing, but why would I talk crazy about the Suns, Devin Booker and them? You just beat my guy. So how so how how stupid would I look to talk crazy about a team that took out my guy and the team I was rooting for to win? Cause they because they have my favorite Like it just doesn't make sense and I don't understand that philosophy. That's real hater stuff. I'm not a hey. I worry about my like myself and my loved ones, but I'm not. You feel me? I know sports is fandom stuff, but I'm not a hater. I don't do that. When when my guy didn't make it to the playoffs in 2019, first year with the Lakers, I wasn't gonna sit here hating on the Warriors because they lost in the 2019 finals. Y'all got to the finals. My guy and the team I wanted to win didn't even make the playoffs. So how can I talk shit about y'all? It just doesn't make sense. I'm a because it doesn't make sense. Anyways, let's get straight to the video. Have to say that because I'm not understanding people right now. Got three people on this song, so let's see. Put it in work for these biz. Okay, get it in a barber shop. That's different. These are clean. These are clean. I'm not even a big fan of, I'm pretty sure these are dunks, right? Yeah, I think they are. If they're not, damn, that's tough. But this is nice. I'm a big star one day and I'm capable. Pango make you or break you, I'm a breakable. Roll showing signs, gotta watch on that change the world. We ain't stopping at real lights, all we know is go. Already know you a snake, all the fake love show. We ain't stopping at red lights, all we know is go. Call my brothers coming, they gon' wipe them nose. Keep that fire on me, stay on my ten toes. Put that on my mama, ain't no bitch, I'll let it go. 
Riding down how we fall in a spaceship Demons on go, I ain't gon' lie, yeah, they fake shit Ain't your regular nigga, baby girl, I ain't basic Just face it, praying to go to heaven, hope I make it Praying to go to heaven, I, I pray I make it, man, me too One thing I'm gonna say off rip I think when I was doing these songs, reacting to these music videos I was looking for lyrics 100% that's cool to do, but sometimes I, I'm not going to say I don't care about lyrics, but that's what separates an artist from just a, a, a writer. You know, you see people who can freestyle all day, but can't make songs, bro. People don't always want to hear freestyle. Like, I like your freestyle, but you need to learn how to make a song. I'm not talking about these people. I'm just saying in general. Sometimes, and somebody had to tell me this. My boy, he even had to tell me. Sometimes I, I don't want to hear conscious stuff sometimes. Sometimes I want to get into the vibe. I don't have to be able to relate that way when you talk about having to maybe having a gun for your protection or doing something that I've never personally done in my life. Oh, you shouldn't listen to that type of music. Woo -woo. Not necessarily. Sometimes people want to get away from like reality for a little bit. They don't always want to listen to conscious things. It's not 100 percent have to be relatable to you. If you like the song, you like the song. You know what I mean? People, I think people got to, the more rappers coming up that understand that, it's not about your freestyle alone. It's not about that because I've seen it. I even I saw, I saw who, because the top artists who've been at the top for years, a lot of people will look at them and say they're not lyricists, which they are, but everybody think a lyricist got to be like someone who's like Nas or the game. You know what I mean? They think that that's lyricism. lyricism. That's not 100% the case all the time. But this right now, this said a couple lines, Big Bands P, that, I, that I'm that messing with. I like it. You know what I mean? I'm liking it so far. My bro just put a phone. Just know if it's in a little jack, don't kick the door. My brother bro be fainting just to hit the door. Ain't had it in the room, but I'm gonna explode. Like my nigga Bird, gotta keep them cookies in the blunt. Put that shit on just to stop. Get that bag, I'm gonna hear I'm in the club. I tell him play my... This is... Y'all peep this? I be peeping everything in the video. Why, why bug the bishop in the car? He got to keep them in the blunt. Like he he knew the car. Like he he knows the line. Like you know he, like he knew what he was saying. Like I read his. Scotty no I'm a big dog, little nigga, you I'ma be a star one day and I'm capable Pain gon' make you or break you, I'ma break the ball Hold on Pain gon' make you or Listen to this, listen to this I'm a big star one day and I'm capable Listen, listen I'm a big dog, little nigga, you I'ma be a star one day and I'm capable Pain gon' make you or break you, I'm unbreakable. I'ma be, I'ma be a star one day, I'm capable. Pain gon' make or break you, I'm unbreakable. Bro, that's a caption right there. I ain't gonna lie, big, I'ma have to, hey, I said it here first, bro. I'ma have to use, I'ma, I'ma have to use that real quick. I like that, you know, I'ma be a star one day, I'm capable. And he kept it short and sweet, I'm not, I'm not, he didn't say I'm capable of that, like I'm capable. Pain gonna make or break you. I'm unbreakable. He gets straight to it. Got the chorus or whatever the the, the hook or whatever you. I don't know whatever it's called. The song, the, the part that you say multiple times in the song. He got that part. You know he. All right. I like how they did this in a barber shop too. It's, it's unique. We don't stop at red lights. All we know is go. They been trying to break me, I ain't breaking. Only thing I'm good at breaking when I break next. We don't save hoes, we just rather save checks. Got tired of taking plays, now we hopping on the jet. Gotta watch out for these snakes, they been flying on me. They been trying to play me close, but we not homies. Gotta keep a blink with stick, cause that's just how it is. Even when you bustin' plays and you handle business, they just wanna see me fall. But you know me, I'm gon' keep ballin'. When it came to them, I did it all. But when I needed them, they wasn't callin'. Yeah. I'm gonna be a star one day and I'm capable. Pain gon' make you or break you. Bro. I've met Scotty No Pippin. He actually kind of sounds like that too. Crazy. Obviously, you they added a little stuff in there, but he actually, you know, he just, you know, he can rap and he harmonized too a little bit. Though. Don't sleep on him. I, I, I. But one thing I'm gonna say, I like his part. He came in. I don't like features where the 
uh, one feature talk for too long, like rap for too long. Even when they part is hella nice, I like the I like he came in, said what he had to say, then boom, next over because they know they got three people on a song pretty much. So okay, I rock with it. And he matched his flow too. He matched Big Pan, Big Band's piece flow. the fuck did he just say? So they give a love of flex. All I gotta do is point and they on your ass and say, You don't wanna meet the bishop, had confessions with the reverend. Take a risk, but be smart, cause it'll take a turn. I know I'm made for the top, it's my seat reserve. Ain't too much. Take a risk, but be what he, he said. Take a risk, be smart. I know I made it to the top, my seat reserved. Wow. I'm trying to tell you. I ain't all three of them. They match each other's flows. All three of them came on, like, the ball, even the lyrics. I was even trying to go, like, like I said, I wasn't always trying to just go for lyrics. Sometimes you got to catch the vibe of the song and the beat. But they all, they matched each other on this song. It wasn't one person did better than the other. Scotty, Scotty, you know, Pippen came in, did what he did. Boogie Bishop came in and Big Bass P, his part was good too. Like, everybody came, like, I reacted to Big Bass P's song before action. I actually said the person... I, big, his his part on that song wasn't all that to me either, but it was way better than the person who he did the song with, you know. And we caught some flack for that, I think, bro. <laughs> but um, yeah. So I could see the like improvement. It's all three of them came hard on this song. We ain't stopping at red lights, all we know is go. It's the same people in, in their music videos too, because I remember I used to always say I hate when people do music videos, there's a million people in the video. Like coming up anyway, like people from this area coming up. And I'm seeing that it's the same people in, 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 in Book the Bitches Viz and, and uh, I haven't reacted to Big Band's P video in a super long time, but they, they rock with the same people. And they got Scotty No Pippin in there doing his thing, bro. This is a good song. Usually I have to replay it. Usually I have to kind of replay it. Even if I like it, sometimes I got to replay it. But this one, I don't even have to replay this one. I, I got what you was trying to do on the first one. On the first go. Big Bands P, Scotty No Pippin, Book the Bishop. Y'all did y'all thing on this song. Y'all did y'all, bro, this is, it's, I just seen, I just seen goddamn, uh, what's in that, Lil Sandino. He just, he, I just seen it last night. He posted a, a song. I was, bro, I was rocking with that. That song was it. I commented, bro, it's, it, people out here cooking up some shit, bro, I can't lie. Y'all got to keep it going. This is, bro, this is two straight songs I, I'm hearing and I'm, I'm, I'm loving, I'm liking. This is it, man. You know, and y'all know I'm always honest about this. I don't be caring about, like, I just, I be honest, bro, you know, but I'm being honest, this song was it. All three of y'all came hard on this, no, like, Nobody carried nobody on this one. If y'all like this video, hit the like button. I'm going to leave the link to their video in the description so y'all can go show them some love on, on this channel. You know, I'm going to go ahead and like the vid. Y'all like this video, hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Recipes to Kari's piece. Actually, this is my grandma, both our grandmas, and I'm out, man.